What's up guys? Coach Stuby and Coach Clark back with another training tip. Today we're going to be using our open-ended trap bar to demonstrate our step-up variations. Uh, this is a great exercise to strengthen the quadriceps, the glutes, the core, and also the low back and shoulders. So it's a great compound full body movement that you can use with your kids. That's also going to stress unilateral stability, which our athletes need tremendously, okay? He'll deadlift the bar up, making sure that he has a back flat, and he's going to step up and approach the box, bench, whatever you're using as a step up apparatus. From there, making sure that we're in the neutral position, straight line from shoulder all the way down to the opposite foot. He is going to step up, trying to keep good posture, not breaking at the hips and leaning forward, and then he will eccentrically control all the way down. We also want to make sure that the knee is tracking in between the big toe and the baby toe here. We don't want the knee going way out, getting us into eversion, but we don't want to pronate at the foot as well. We want to make sure that knee is not moving and we are controlling the movement throughout the range of motion. He went three reps on his right leg, three reps on his left leg. Again, if we're going to stress stability, we can't ask them to go eight reps deep on each leg. We need to make sure that the volume's a little bit lower here so we can emphasize stability. From there, we'll go into an alternating step up. All right, coach's grip's probably fried right now. All right, great job, coach. He explodes up, controls down. This is going to be more of a fluid movement, less of the eccentric emphasis here, making sure that we're still controlling down, stepping up, having that whole foot on the ground. Okay, we want to make sure that they're not just having the ball of the foot there. That's going to cause them to be unstable. We want to make sure that that entire foot is flush on whatever box or bench they're stepping up on so that we can make sure that they're going to have the ability to stabilize the ankle, knee, and hip. But again, guys, this is a training tip. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us. See you next week.